The Rhino is an unchecked powerhouse, and we should all be concerned. The power dynamic in Super Auto Pets has been turned on its head. This game, like any auto battler, employs a series of checks and balances to ensure one build doesn't trump them all. For snipes, you have potatoes and melons. For summons, you have iguana and royal flycatcher. In this instance, there is no check for the Rhino. No potatoes to block it. No skunks to take its health down before it one-shots the team. It's a tough weekly to try any build that doesn't have a Rhino. It took insanely long just to get these games in, and I had to resort to a Rhino to get to the end of the game. I'm not even kidding, I'm talking tens of games that I couldn't get to 10 wins just because I keep getting stomped by Rhino teams. I like the Bunyip. I could dig a Silk Moth here. So I've come to realize one startling observation. It seems as though there aren't very many, how should I word this, good combos in <laughs> this weekly. Um, you you kind of just have to play the highest statted guys you can and then go into like a rhino with some frost wolf or something. I'm hoping that's not the case, um, but that's kind of what I'm noticing so far. But we'll see. We're going to give it a shot. See what we can come up with. Hopefully something at least remotely interesting. I gotta admit, I'm not a huge fan of just running Rhino every game, but it definitely seems like it's the stronger of the options. Okay, so far so good. I like being at five, as do most people, I would think. Mandrake is huge for similar reasons as we typically see a lot of Frost Wolves. Speaking of, Frost Wolf me. Run it like this. Not too bad. We're getting close here. I like the level. Early sea line is fantastic. Maybe we get rid of you. Run a little something like this, and then we'll roll a couple times. Huge. I think this counts as huge, personally. If I do say so myself. That That's about expected for a camel. <laughs> There's not much to do with that. I think this is good. I don't think it's a buffalo angle. Doberman, not yet. But maybe soon. I don't even think we need a fried shrimp here. See, you're gonna gain six, you're a nine twelve. It's not bad, honestly. N twelve, sorry. Forgot about my sea line. That's the frost coming in. Frost effects are pretty good. Now let's go. I think we roll, see what we can find here. I mean, I like the turtle, don't get me wrong. Let me run it like this. Get another sea lion going. Maybe we can make something happen, I don't know. Should have put the, the tree behind, that's on me. Not behind, he should have been put ahead of the sea lion. So now we desperately need a tree. Can we find one? Maybe we go llama. Do we get rid of the tree? No, it's just too, I'd, I don't like the llama. I don't like getting the two. We found a tree, no worries. Rhino is interesting. Maybe this is a get rid of a bunyip kind of vibe. Run it like this. Do you 12? Alright. Our rhino is going to be our stand in for the bunyip. Because long term, he's going to be a lot better. No hate, that's just, that's how it be. Okay, you can pair me here. Huge hit. Yeti seems pretty solid. 
We get rid of tree here. Tree has less high end potential. The rhino needs to go here though, so maybe get rid of turtle. Tree will be our next elimination. Found some frost wolves. That's that's not bad. Oh, come on. The one health. You hate to see that. Alright, well, let's get you level 3. Rhino definitely needs a level up. Hopefully we can find something here with our... With our Yeti. We found one. One Rhino is better than no Rhino. And this is where the Rhino comes to play. That's, that's basically the gist of it, right? It's not... <laughs> it's no groundbreaking achievement, but... You know, that's, that's how it be. Throwing a tiger in place of the tree and I think we're good to go. I'm gonna run it like this. The tree was too high attack. So we didn't get coconut. So we're gonna run it kinda like this. I can't believe we only found one duplicate. That's crazy. Oh no. <laughs> He's got the rhino tiger as well. Mind me. Tiger me. We gotta get the rhino. Come on. That counts. <laughs> That's good enough. Grab a yeti here. I think this is hopefully good enough. The rhino's pretty big. Nope. This is what I'm telling you. The rhinos, it's its just a rhino weekly. That's all it is. You got to get a big rhino early with maybe a tiger, maybe a frost wolf in front. That's how it's going. Everybody does it. Okay, I like the bunyip. Bunyip is great news. I don't know if we need this many otters right now. <laughs> we'll be some gooey gladiators. I feel like that's what gladiators would be like nowadays. It all just be gooey. All right, bunyip me. Go here, here. Rock a flamingo. We're four squatting it, but honestly, we're doing pretty well for a four squad. What did I say? <laughs> four squads are sometimes good. This being one of those times. Rock it like this. Huge. I don't want to combine these two if possible, just because they already have some stats on them. But we will if needed. Roll me. Maybe we fried shrimp this guy. Oh, he's got a chocolate cake flamingo. What the heck? This guy's got all sorts of new tech. Alright, we can combine them now. Let's throw in a little extra attack beforehand. That's big. I mean, Saiga Antelope? No. Surely not. Keep the Ogopogo in case. Kind of like this, maybe? I don't know if this is gonna really sell it, but hey. Maybe. <laughs> so far, so good. It's doing great. Alright, level me here. That's fantastic. Flamingo. Maybe Ogopogo, because we're gonna have Sea Line in the front. I think he can go. I key kind of want a kangaroo here. Hmm, I think we roll. Don't want to grab you. Husky is like the best team scaling in the weekly. 
So I'm trying to set it up in such a way that we could operate with a husky. Well, this is not going to end well, in case that wasn't readily apparent. Okay, level me here. I want to find another otter before we sell. We might not be able to. Roll me once. That's big. <laughs> Alright, we found the husky. I'm wondering, what if we just get rid of you? Okay, so you're going to be an 11-12. Alright, we won't get rid of you just yet. But soon. And this is why we didn't get the garlic. We're preparing for the huskies. That's basically how this works. That can't be worth it, right? Chocolate caking or... Whatchamacallum? What is this guy? The chupacabra? I can't imagine that it's actually paying off. <laughs> you know? It seems so bad. Go here and here. Gonna get a big old chupacabra. I don't know why the kangaroo's behind the rabbit. You really shouldn't be. <laughs> but this is why. So you can break the, the coconut. Hey. That's called not thinking, and it works out. <laughs> okay, we could go a tiger. I think we probably should go a tiger, right? Freeze me. Tiger Rhino. <laughs> I don't like this. And now we roll. Here, here, here. Oh, dude, we're cooking. All right, you got a big homie. I respect it. Okay, now we're gonna go here. <laughs> this feels dirty. All right, so we're at 1432 on our rhino. Surely that's going to do something for us, right? Oh, <laughs> it does not. We're getting there, though. We need some levels. That's our issue. We can definitely go fried shrimp here. Just a 3-1. Our whole build is hinging on this tiger. Rhino combo. <laughs> I thought that was gonna wipe us out. I'm glad our cow was good enough. Roll me. Freeze me. Huge. That is enormous, actually. Okay, shouldn't have kept the pear frozen once we found our item. gonna draw um I mean it's gotta go on the rhino right rhino level two first and then we'll cow that's gonna be the strat I don't think we need a husky husky is a little too late I mean, this, uh, what am I telling you, right? <laughs> There's no beating it. There really isn't. Let's go here first. Get you just about 50. We'll tip it over the edge with the, with the husky. And just get a whole boatload of cows, apparently. Now we need some more rhinos, more tigers. That's it. That's how we win. Is 
There it is. Roll me. Let me just rock this. And so it begins. <laughs> Oh man, I'll tell you, I'm not proud of this. I really am not. It does not bring, it brings me a little joy, but it doesn't, it doesn't satisfy that itch, you know? This is very much the way to win, but I'll tell you, dude, I've straight up, I have tried so many different builds this weekly. This is the only one that works. Like, we'll keep trying, don't get me wrong. We're gonna keep trying to break the meta, but holy moly, this weekly is something else. <laughs> I hope you enjoy. I certainly did most of the time. If you do, drop a like, comment, sub. Love to hear from y'all. But for now, I will see you all in the next episode. Have a good one.